Cancerians, Kimmy Chantress here to do a musician's reading. It is the full moon and eclipse in Libra for 2024 in March. So we'll get started, guys. 11th to the 25th of March is this exquisite full moon in Libra. Now it is in opposition to the sun in Aries. And this moon's growth will culminate in a full moon and eclipse. In Libra so it intensifies senses and you know your sensitivity to harmony and disharmony beauty and imperfection so you know the moon in Libra is about bringing peace to all your relationships in music and love so you will flourish you know the number 19 here on the card breaks down to a 10 which in turn breaks down to a 1 new beginnings the uh eclipse in libra is all about rebalancing relationships or even reevaluating if these are the right people that should be on your journey in music you know whether there's justice and fair play coming into the situation and uh, the number 31 breaks down to a four so this is about finding stability in in uh in your outfit now, Cancer, we've got the Sun in Aries, which is taking a leap of faith. New beginnings with a number one card there. You know, you could be um, in an outfit that consists of three people. So let's take a look at the overall energies from the Lenormand cards. We have the clouds. So seems to be a little bit of confusion. And we've got the ship. Maybe confusion on how to move forward. So, you know, maybe that your career is unsteady at this present time, Cancer. And perhaps you're in this energy of not knowing where to go or how to go forward with your music. Or what even the outcome will be. But, you know, you may even change your career because you're feeling irritable at this present time. You could be uncertain about travelling. Now, if you've been waiting for something to appear in your music, I do feel it's going to arrive around this time. Now, good business can be expected for you. And, you know, you have to use your intuition, Cancer, to navigate how to get work, the workplace. Um, how you you going to do this with your music? Now, if you've been following the music readings regularly you will all know that this is my significated card and it's the uh, card of artists of all types so whether you play an instrument you sing you dance um you play other people's music on the radio whatever the case may be you could be even a um recording artist you could be a sound engineer but it all has to do with music, so please take it in your situation. Now we have the woman and the fox that's come out for you. So this is a woman that's significant in your life, Cancer. And I usually use the card uh, for the fox for my work card. So what it's telling me is, you know, you could be involved with a woman who's very intuitive and psychic. Um could be well known or feeling a little bit hormonal at this point in time but you may come to acknowledge that things have changed around this person now this woman could be developing her psychic abilities i do have aries in the reading uh so it could be an aries person um with the mice is also here the mice and stalk so let's see if it can stay up i'll just pop in here so yeah it could be all about creativity cancer dreaming of how to do things better how to get a better job how to be recognized for something different and creative that you normally do now uh you could be you know changing uh, from djing to being in a band or you could be changing from being a drummer to playing bass or even changing from 
being a guitarist to a singer or combining whatever the case is in your situation. So you have gone through some stressful cycles, I feel. Uh, but I feel like, you know, you've achieved well under all the stress you've been going through. Now, you are seeing the anxiety which a situation caused you. And you could be recognising the stress that a person is causing you to move forward. So let's see. Okay, now for the outcome, we have the sun. It's been coming up for all the sun signs. So that's the Leo, Leo energy, but it's the sun in Aries also. And you've got the birds. So, you know, you I feel around this uh, full moon and eclipse in Libra, you're going to be guided through your intuition towards the success. You know, you may move slowly towards it, but you will remain happy and optimistic. The sun may be even blinding you to a truth of a situation. But there's going to be triumph and success and all the things that you've hoped for. So that's beautiful, Cancer. Now, I'm not going to leave the reading there. I am going to pull some more cards for you. So I'm not quite sure what this des uh, deck is. So if you know, please comment below and let me know. Okay. We have four beautiful Cancerians moving forward. So there will be a lot of negotiations that, you know, could make you feel a little bit uncertain. And it could be someone who's trying to manipulate you. But I feel through all the anxiety that you've been going through, Cancer, there's changes that are going to happen for you. Thank you. Yes. Okay. Keep making friends. Be the instigator. Open your life to someone new. It will enrich you both. Okay. Let's see. Now, you've drawn this card because there are ideas for how to enjoy life. Simple, straightforward things that you can try to do more of. So keep making friends, you know. Um, you never know who you could run into and um, someone that's going to be more beneficial to your your music path. Uh, actually, I might do the goddesses and goddess. Goddesses, gods and guardians cards first for you, Cancer. Thank you. Okay, so we have Hathor, and I know this came out for one of the other star signs. Um, let me just see. So, soul family. So, maybe someone is coming towards you, you know. Um, you know, so you're realizing that someone's causing you anxiety, so you're looking... You know, making new friends, uh, new music friends, perhaps. Now, let's see. So, Hathor came out for you today, Cancer, as a destined reunion. So, support from your journey is here. So, someone you're re reuniting with. And, uh, you know, a magical time of reconnecting with your soul family has arrived. When you incarnated in this lifetime, your soul plan to reunite with its ancient lineage, kindred spirits that you knew in previous lifetimes, both on earth and the cosmos. You don't have to know how this will happen. It's written in the stars that you'll be brought together. So that's beautiful. When you meet members of your soul family, it's an instant intuitive recognition of mutual understanding and emotional safety. So as I said, um, you know, you'll be following your intuition towards your success. Now, you won't need to analyse why you feel so seen and supported by them. It can be an unspoken knowing that brings relief from a previously solitary soul-guided path. Your soul family will always want you to shine brightly. They won't be threatened by your expansion or successes. On the contrary, some of them will go out of their way to help you achieve your spiritual mission. This may be a time of reinitiation into the moon temples where you'll rediscover sacred teachings, engage in magical rituals and connect with lunar cycles. So you can see your soul family behind you. So 
you know, you may share an important soul connection with this person. And Hathor is here to guide you through your intuition. Now you need to receive some motherly love from this person, friend or group who can look after you. Okay, so you may want to join a singing or music class. And your invocation here, Cancer, is I'm not alone. My soul family are arriving to lift me up. So that's, a, that's really beautiful. Now one more card from the Native American Oracle for our beautiful Cancerians. Please hear it. What do we have for our beautiful Cancerians, please. Number six, I'm going to read that one for you. It's like a beaver or something. Uh, give me one second, I could be wrong. Oh, it is beaver. Okay, so it's about construction. Beaver is smart, hands-on, practical, make it happen smart. He is an engineer and builder, both rational and creative. In his work, we see the perfect application of inspiration and ideas. The beaver is not a plotter, though he takes only the time necessary to figure out a solution and then proceeds to do what needs doing. With efficiency and very often with style. Being able to work with materials this world shows a deeper connection than simply physical. To create, to synthesize form and function with environment awareness and with beauty requires a relationship with the elemental spirits of one's building materials. The canoe is another symbol of efficient engineering. Okay, so you know you need to look deeper to find the understanding required for the most elegant solutions so there's something creative and inspiring that you're trying to come up with uh it could be in the way of stage props or things like that and you've got your soul family here to help you so it's about construction understanding how things work creative inspiration problem solving beauty style work physical world so the timing could be around may where you'll see the growth of this project that you're um, embarking on guys so lots of love to you cancer wishing all the best and i will see you for your musicians reading in may please like and subscribe to the channel um definitely if it resonated i would love to hear some comments below and the name of your outfit so talk soon bye for now